So I just wanted to talk to you today a little bit about health assessments and getting that done before you buy a horse. So many people go out and buy a horse now and they might get a vet check done, but a lot of times they don't even get that done. And I don't think a lot of people think about actually getting a health assessment done on their horse. I've had that done on my horses and I highly recommend it. And the equine specialist that I have do it, she uses kinesiology to test them. And she actually tests all the organs of your horse and if there's any problems uh, within any of the organs. And then they test for uh, vitamin or mineral deficiencies, they test for heavy metals. And what they do is, using kinesiology, they use muscle testing and they use a surrogate to do that with your horse and they will test the energy of each organ and find out if it's strong or it's weak so if it needs some attention or there's something going on there and also test things like the skin, um, bone, muscle, all that sort of stuff and then they will go ahead and test specific remedies against those organs or skin or things like that to try and find something that will set up a good program for your horse to get them in the best physical condition that they can be in. And I've seen people that haven't gotten that done and they've bought a horse, they've got the horse home and all of a sudden they have a poor coat quality on their horse, their horse is lethargic, anemic, not the same horse that they bought, uh, personality seems to have changed in the horse and uh, it all has to do with uh, organs that may need a cleanse like a kidney cleanse or a liver cleanse, uh, intestinal cleanse. I know uh, my horse ended up having a belly full of gravel which I didn't know um, beforehand that she had been eating sand and gravel and we're thinking even maybe a year before I got her and once we got the sand and gravel out of her with a remedy that worked very well, we had to go ahead and deal with all the emotional issues that she was dealing with from her past as well, which I worked again with the equine specialist for using flower essence or certain remedies that could deal um, with her past issues and we're really moving forward with that now. She was uh, slightly metabolic when I got her and she couldn't even graze for longer than 20 minutes without colicking on me. But now after a couple of years, now she can graze. We've had her up to two and a half hours without any problems. So anyways, I would highly recommend getting a health assessment done before you go to buy a horse. Then you know what you're getting yourself into before you go and spend all that money to uh, buy a horse and sometimes even thousands of dollars after you've bought the horse if you didn't get a health assessment done. I've seen that happen to people before. So anyways, that's just some of the stuff that I do and if you don't know about kinesiology, look it up on the net. It is a great way to test your horse and find out what is the best program for them. I get mine tested on a regular basis and they just keep getting healthier and healthier, happier and happier. They're just great to be around. They, they're just healthy, happy horses. So best of luck to you and look into health assessments before you buy a horse.